Hello, welcome back to my kitchen. I am going to wash dishes again. Ha ha. <laughs> so, it's a day to do dishes. And I have some new gloves. These are pinkish purple. I got these from Walmart and I got them for like less than $3. I have a feeling the pink ones that I buy at Dollar Tree are cheaper, but these have a fabric lining. It actually feels like fabric on the inside. So that's why it costs it more. The other ones are good quality and they work. So are these, but that's the difference. Is these have a cotton lining on the inside. And they work. All that matters really is that they work. So I'm gonna start by running some warm water into the sink. I'm getting my dish soap. I'm using the um, Fiesta Lime that I got from Quincy. Dish soap. I like it. it. It smells exactly like Fiesta Lime. The person that named it did a good job and they got that smell spot on. That's exactly what it smells like, Fiesta Lime. So if you haven't washed your dishes, go ahead, prop your phone up in the kitchen with me and wash your dishes with me. We can do our dishes together. We can get it done. Because we know that independent living comes with chores and responsibilities, a process that we have to go through to achieve success. And our chores is part of that process. We want clean dishes so that we can be healthy. And that's why we're cleaning our dishes. If you have money to pay somebody else to wash the dishes for you, congratulations. But even if you do have money to pay for someone else to do the dishes, I don't know why a person wouldn't do them unless they just had way too many things to do. That I would understand that. Or if maybe their kids needed to learn how to do the dishes, I would totally understand that. But if you're rich and you're paying someone to do your dishes, that's not a good use of your money unless you're just too busy to do it because you're busy getting rich. But, I mean, if you're not busy and you're just paying someone else to do it, nope, that's not a good use of your money. Yeah, me giving advice to rich people, huh, right? But seriously, I know how to live independently. that's not a good choice. If you don't know how to do dishes, watch me. Wash my dishes to help you learn how to wash your dishes. My dishes get clean. I may not be the number one dishwasher in the world, but my dishwasher, my dishes get clean. And I stay healthy because my dishes are clean. I stay healthy from the things that you can have wrong with you from having dirty dishes. Yeah, that is not something that I am always concerned about because I know that I clean my dishes. Now, if I was eating off a dirty dish, I'm sure I'd be getting sick a lot more.
One thing that um, kids try to do, and maybe some adults and possibly some men too. Well, okay, so I guess adults and men are the same thing, right? Yeah. <laughs> uh, but they will just wash, scrub part of the dish, like the main part that they thought was exposed to the food that got it dirty and they will skip scrubbing the part that did, they don't think was exposed to anything. And they end up not washing part of the dish and missing a lot because they thought that they would just scrub the main dirty contents off and go with that. So I've seen that before and it's, it's not right because you're gonna, you could, you're missing washing parts of your dish and you're not washing it all the way. And also, I noticed that some children and teenagers, probably, because I know because I smell them, uh, miss washing themselves properly. Probably the same way that a person will wash the part of the dish that they thought was the dirtiest. I think that's what some people are doing in the bathtub when they're washing their body, just washing the part that they think is the dirtiest. And that's not how you do it. You have to wash the entire body, the full thing, every piece of skin exposed. Wash it all, you know? <laughs> or you're missing parts of it. You're missing washing parts of it if you're not washing it all. That goes with dishes, that goes with your body, that goes with anything you're washing. If you're going to wash it, wash it all the way. Especially your dishes in your body. Those are things that it's very important for you to wash all the way. You only get one body in this life. And dishes hold the food that you put into that body. So, yeah, that's why they're so important. I fed my son some soup today. It's always good to feed someone some soup. I just like doing soup sometimes, especially in the winter. Winter is so cold and soup just makes things feel better.